You guys, I cannot remember the last time I was actually excited for a planner. So I've liked and enjoyed a lot of the planners that I have been using over, I would say, the past couple of years. Um, they've been functional. I've enjoyed them to a certain extent. I've had an Erin Condren Life Planner. Um, I've used a variety of different ones from Target, Walmart. Um, but I love, like genuinely love this planner. It is so affordable. I'm going to link it down below for you guys. I have been searching far and wide. I can't wait to show you guys this planner. If you're also excited about this planner, I hope that you'll give this video a thumbs up. I really think you guys are going to love it. So before, like I said, I was using an Erin Condren life planner. It was great, but as I explained in one of my recent um, chatty like car vlog videos, I felt like that planner was just a little bit too much. It was a little bit too organized. Um, there was just a, a little bit too much happening and it was really big. And because I'm going to be traveling a lot over the next few months, I didn't think that it was going to be very practical for me to travel with that. And I really wanted to move my whole system into my Louis Vuitton desk agenda, which I have ordered stickers for this. They're back ordered. I can't wait for them to come so I can show you guys finally. They're so cute. Um, just leather stickers for the outside. But anyway... So I wanted to move everything into that. So I was armed with like measurements and I got to searching and I ordered so many planners and I tried so hard and I couldn't find anything that I liked until I got this one from Amazon. I think it was like less than $15. The quality is amazing. I'm just going to show you guys the details of this planner. I've already moved into it. It's already set up. But I'm not going to do a full like setup of this. I'm going to use it for a little bit longer. I've been using it for about a month. I'm going to use it a little bit longer and then I will do one more planner setup video with this. I know that I just recently did a setup video, but that was kind of the end. Like I was reaching the, my limit um, with that setup. So moving into this, I'm just so, so happy. So I just want to show you guys this actual planner. Um, and I wanted to share the link so you guys could get this if you are also on the hunt. I guess I'm just so excited. Let's do this. Okay. I wish that I would have filmed this for you all before I moved in. Um, I can still, I mean, there's still some empty pages so I can show you guys, but I was just so excited when I got it that I couldn't wait to move into it. And like I said, I just have not been that inspired in so long. So it was just like, such a nice refreshing feeling to like actually be excited about using my planner and moving into a planner. So I'm sorry that I can't show you exactly what it looks like when you get it out of the package, but what I've done here is put my daily affirmation sticker, which if you guys missed the news, I have reopened my sticker shop. You can get all of my most popular stickers, the life essential stickers, the office essential stickers. You can get both of them. There's a capsule wardrobe planning super set. There's just so many um, cool stickers. I'm really proud of the designs that I've made because I wasn't finding anything that I really liked. And so I designed them all myself and I've re-released all of your past favorites. So if there's one that you missed that you didn't get, you can grab those. And then I also have a brand new manifestation and affirmation sticker set. It's two pages. I think it's incredible. I'm so proud of that sticker set as well. Anyway, this is one of the stickers that's included in it. It's a daily affirmations sticker. So I put that on the front page of this planner. So again, I'm sorry that you can't see like exactly what it's going to look like, but the planner when it comes does have like a logo here. And obviously I was going to cover that up, but I like the rest of the page. It's just like a dot grid. So like I said, I just put my sticker here, but this front page is perfect to be customized yourself. And as you can see, it does also include a clear frosted cover. So that page is the first and then, okay, you guys are kind of seeing what I've done to it. I'm sorry. I also did stick, um, these, floral stickers. These are not my designs. I got them from, I think TJ Maxx. It was like, came with like 10 sheets of floral, um, initial stickers. And so I put my initials here and then it does also come with this, um, page. 
And my plan, as you can see, is to make this a vision board. So the back side of that warranty page is just lined. You could put a variety of things here. Um, you could put your contact information if you wanted, maybe your word for the year. I think that would be great. And then it does have two years, 2019 to 2020. This is an academic year planner, which was perfect for me because um, I think it starts in like June. I'll double check to make sure. But um, obviously this is like later on in the year that I'm getting this. So I didn't want all of um, 2019. So I can definitely use this for an entire year. And in fact, what I ended up doing is just taking out some of the pages, um, the weekly pages, so that this would be a little bit thinner. And then it goes straight into the monthly. So it does start with June 2019. I've come over to April 2020 because I wanted to show you guys a blank page so that you could see um, a layout exactly what it looks like because like I said I have moved in but it's spacious on the monthly view there's plenty of room you can see that there's just a blank section over here for you could do notes monthly goals um, and then it's a Sunday start the paper quality is thick but not too thick it's this really beautiful chic kind of cream color if you are using this for a Louis Vuitton desk agenda, it's perfect. If only the coils were gold, but come on, for like under $15 and on Amazon, we're not going to be too picky. I mean, a girl can dream, but this is really still really chic. I mean, it's just minimal. The font is nice. It's not crazy. There's no like graphics. I mean, I just love this. Okay, so the monthly layout and then it goes into a week on two pages. I love this layout. You guys, I love this planner. It's just really minimal. It has the days, the date, days of the week and the dates at the top, but you can see like the font is nice and it is vertical. I'm really loving the vertical layout. So I was happy that it's vertical and they've taken each day and kind of broken it up into two. So the top is just dotted lines and then the bottom half has times. So I've been using this a variety of different ways. Sometimes I've been putting daily to do's and then actual like schedule down here. Um, sometimes I just use this as one big column to write things out. Um, you know, the times here are not so like big and dark and intrusive that you can't like use them for anything else. Like it's light enough that if you don't want to use those time slots, you don't have to. And like I said, I've been using it both ways. When I film the planner setup, I'll show you guys kind of different ways that I've been using it. Um, and then the weekends are split in one column and then it does have this current month and the next month, just an overview as well. It's just so versatile. I just, oh my gosh, I love this so much. It doesn't have tabs for the months. So if you're someone that really has to have tabs, you could just DIY your own. But so far, that hasn't been bothering me too much. You can, because it's a spiral um, coil, you can use the Erin Condren bookmarks in here. I have used them and actually I'm using one for my notes pages um, and then I use one as a today marker. So I'll show you more about that when I film the setup. And then in the very back, there are three notes pages. Now I realize that's not a lot. Um, I have come up with a solution so that you can use the, get like more use out of the note pages. So I'll show you guys that when I film my setup. Um, but really I'm not using this for notes. And because this is so slim, like compared to an Erin Condren, I can still fit a really thin notebook in my desk agenda. Um, cloth and paper has absolutely beautiful notebooks and that would be a great um, thing to like pair up with this if you did need more notes pages. And then the back cover is this super thick cardboard, but then it does also have this clear frosted plastic as well. So the clear plastic is what I've been putting, um, using to put this into my desk agenda, but then it still has this to protect the paper. So you can just slip it in like this and carry it around in the agenda. You can also put that plastic piece in there. I just love this planner so much. 
I have been so excited to share this with you guys. I've been showing like little sneak peeks on Instagram and getting questions about it. And it's been so hard for me to not tell you guys where it is, but I just wanted to save it so that I could do a proper video to show you guys. I just, I can't say enough good things about it. It is minimal. I feel like it, the cream paper is thick and makes it kind of chic and luxurious. And I just, I love this thing. I hope that they never discontinue it. And I have to say they have wonderful customer service. When I ordered this off Amazon, um, it came a little bit damaged in the back and I emailed them. They immediately sent me another one. They were like, don't even worry about sending the damaged one back. Um, they were just great. I mean, Amazon has great customer service too, but I wanted to specifically contact the company because they do actually send you an email and they're like, if you have any issues, like contact us directly. So I wanted to, so that I could speak to like their customer service and the company was phenomenal. I asked them if they would give me a discount code for you guys and they didn't respond to that. So I'm sorry that I don't have a code for you guys. Um, this is not like obviously not sponsored. I mean, I purchased this myself off Amazon um, with my own money, but I just, I mean, I can't get over it. It's so affordable. Like I said, I have not been this excited about a planner and I can't remember how long, probably years. So it's made me so motivated and inspired to actually use my planner every day. I think that's probably my number one productivity tip is get you something that gets you excited. So I hope that this um, is exciting for you guys as well. And like I said, if you want these stickers or any of my planner stickers, I'll have those linked down below for you guys. Let me know if you get this. Oh my gosh, let me know. Like you've got to tag me on Instagram because I want to see how you're using it. I hope you guys love this video. I promise I will film a setup because it's just so good. I'll show you guys how I've been using the days in different ways. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Please make sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys soon.